Thank you for joining us for our song and story today. We've had a nice couple days. We've had Grandma and Grandpa here. Grammy and Beep, as my children call them. And Andrew's exploring Grammy's phone. We're thankful you're here. We've got a little story and song today. Not a whole lot. Nathaniel's up playing with Beep, having the time of his life. So Andrew and I are doing the story today, aren't we, Andrew? With Andrew in the family, happy, happy home, happy, happy home, happy, happy home. With Andrew in the family, happy, happy home, happy, happy home. So we went to a consignment sale yesterday and I got the kids some new books. One of them that we got is called That's Not My Otter. Its nose is too shiny. Uh. Yeah, what do you think, Andrew? Look at this. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. <laughs> I know. Look, 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 look. Do you see that? That's not my otter. Its nose is too shiny. Hey, Mom. That's not my otter. Its no its paws are too rough. Yeah, look at that, Droodle Bug. Oh, let's turn the page. That's not my otter. Its ears are too fuzzy. Yeah, look at that, Droodle. Oh, that's the cover. There's the nose. His nose is too squishy. Yeah, let's look at another page. That's not my otter. Oh, its tail is too soft. Look at his tail. Don't you like reading the book upside down, guys? Well, Andrew's enjoying it, so that's a good thing. He's just starting to become aware of books and... That's not my otter. Its tongue is too smooth. And then he has other things on his mind. Well, at least you get to see the book right side up. That's my otter. Its tummy is so fluffy. That makes for a good book. That's not my otter. These books are by Fiona Watt and Rachel Wells. We have several in this collection, but we found one we didn't have, so we wanted to share it with you guys today. All right, Doodle Bug. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Come back again. We'll see you soon. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye.